Hello and welcome. Today we're taking a look at Objects in Space. This is a game developed by Flat Earth Games, all about captaining a spaceship in this sort of open world sandbox uh, kind of a thing. We are uh, the captain of a ship being whatever we want to do. We can be a bounty hunter, we can be a, a, a trader, maybe a smuggler or a, a salvager, and just sort of making our way through this, this universe. Um, it has really that, uh, remember those old 90s submarine games where you're kind of monitoring each of your systems and your modules and trying to read your sensor data and your radar and trying to figure out what you're doing? It's kind of like one of those. We're in the shoes of our captain watching various screens and trying to make our way through here without getting blown up, basically is the idea. Um, but yeah, this came out on uh, Early Access just a couple days ago. I got the key from GOG to show this one off, so thank you, GOG. Link will be down below. But uh, let's try this thing out and see what it's all about. We've got a campaign here going up. I'm actually going to ahead and go, and go ahead and start up one that I've already started a bit of. Maybe like 10 minutes, just to kind of get past the first wordy bits. Um, but yeah, straight out of the 90s. Uh, so we're on the, uh, we're at Lago, Lago Gas Port. This is a star base right now out here in, uh, in space. There is a bit of story here. So the story goes, we are, um, we are part of a colony, a colony ship uh, convoy. And they went through this wormhole to jump to the next system. We got lost in some sort of time dilation thing, and we showed up 45 years late. So the system's been colonized, and now we just showed up. So I have purchased a ship. I have a, uh, a job delivering somebody, uh, or sorry, some hydrogen to a different station. So we're going to go deliver that right now. We're going to do a bit of a tour of my ship. Um, first off, request permission to dock. Granted. Okay. Now coming through here. So we could just walk using the arrow keys. I'm just using the right arrow key to walk around the station and just view, visit various parts of it. Let's walk onto my ship first, though, and see what it's all about. So let's shut the cargo, uh, the uh, airlock doors and see what we have here. So I've got a communication system here. This is our first stop. Um, I don't know what AutoSync does, but we're going to turn it on. Seems like something we should have. If I want to check out my mail, I can, I can check out any mail. No mail today. Um, we can go back into... I can check the news also. We got all kinds of news. Some sort of attack going on. There's there's a big story here with all these different corporations and things that are uh, having problems. Next up, we have the engineering room. We can see all of our different systems here. We've got sensors, for instance. Some of these will occasionally will just fall apart, and we'll have to you know toss out some chips, go buy some new ones, and strap some new ones in there, some wires, that kind of a thing, and do some various maintenance on this stuff occasionally if it ever goes bad. Next up, we have our power room. We can make, sh make sure all of our things are working right. Uh, batteries are all fully operational. Communications, uh, I don't know what that is. We do have an MCON mode where if we want to run a little, more si a little more silent, we can maybe shut some things down and be a little, a little bit quieter. If we want to make be a little more sneaky through, uh, through certain parts of space. And then we finally got the bridge. So on the bridge, we've got our main radar here. Uh, would radar be the right word? Our main screen here uh, of where we are. We're, we're here at the uh, in the Leo system at this station. Uh, we are docked at the moment. We're ready to undock. We can go ahead and do that. Let's go ahead and do it. Removing docking clamps, detaching from shore power. I got my main power right here. We are gaining power at the moment because we're just sitting here doing nothing. So my batteries are charging. And here we go. We are ready. We're out in space at the moment. We're um, just adrift at the moment. We don't know where to go. But first off, we're going to turn on our IFF. This is our tracking our uh, tracking signal, basically, that we are broadcasting, saying who we are and, and what we're doing so that the cops don't come after us. Uh, but our mission is to fly to... Where are we supposed to go? We're supposed to go down here to Crassus Harbor. So let's plot a course and engage. Any game that lets me say engage is, is all right in my book. So we are we are turning we're, we are turned our ship that direction and now we are initiating our burn, and we're heading that direction. So now our burn is done. So now our power will will fill back up. We have these red bars, which is giving us sort of our noise meter. This is how no we're being very noisy right now because all systems are running and we're just cruising through space, not a care in the world. Uh, occasionally there will be scary things out there, and we may want to run a little more, you know, silent. Um, we've got this over here. This is our this is our nerd display. <laughs> Um, we can come in here and we can see, let's go check out St. John of Parsis over here. This is a ship. We're going to click on this ship, and we can see some readings on this guy. St. John of Parsis, what kind of class ship it is. We get various readings down here, the sort of radiation, whatever signals it's giving off. Um, we'll come across certain things where you can see where he's going, where he's uh, from, that kind of a thing. Um, we get different readings based on what we see. We'll come across some probably in here. We, don't, we won't know what they are. And judging by the various 
readings here, we may sort of get an idea. Is it an asteroid? Is it a, is it a, a hidden ship running silent? Is it uh, just a radar glitch kind of a thing? So that's, that's what we're doing here. We'll see that popping up on, down here. Um, I think we're in good shape. It says I have a new mail. Let's go see what the mail's all about. Uh, man, it's a noisy room down here. Let's see what the mail is. Oh, Leslie. Hey, Leslie. Uh, so Leslie is this guy who, ma who greeted us, and he's trying to tell us what to do. Get out of here, Leslie. I don't need your help. All right. So, everything's running good. We're going to go ahead and... What is that? Somebody's looking at me. Let's go ahead and increase the speed. Time compression. Times four. We're going to cruise that way. So you see this blue guy here. This is a cop who uh, we want to make sure that we are, you know, not smuggling or whatever. He's probably going to scan us as we get close to him and make sure we're not doing anything too fishy. You know, fishy things happen around these parts. Right now we're just delivering hydrogen, though, down here. So uh, nothing really to worry about. So we're going to just keep on cruising. I'm going to see if we get... Oh, here's one. Here's one. So we have a question mark here. So what is this? We don't know. We're getting really nothing about this. Completely unknown. We have no idea what's going on. It's just a tiny little blip here. It may just be some sort of random rock in space, some sort of sensor malfunction, something like that. If it's a little more exciting, then we'll know maybe there's actually something there. But uh, I think it was just, just nothing here. What do you want, Traveler? You're heading to Pentinent Commercial, which is down this way. Okay. That's fine. We are going to Crassus Harbor. So we're going to run in here and dock up. And uh, we'll go visit this place and see what this place is all about. You can see I just, I'm just i spinning around now so I can I can back up into the place. Getting back to 1x time. We are docking clamps extended. Docking clamps uh, attached. Engaging proximity mode. Life support sync. Check. Done. Welcome to Crassus Harbor. Okay, we're here. So let's go, uh, let's go visit. Um, I suppose we could power down if we wanted to, but I, I don't think we need to do that. I think we're good. Let's go, uh, let's go visit. Let's go open the dock. Open the airlock. Hop on in. So welcome to Crassus Harbor Airlock 8. Uh, this guy here is looking at me. Some of them we can talk to. We got, uh, the pizza place. We have the local mechanic and engineering. Do you have something to say to me? No? Um, uh, so we can come in here and we can buy new modules if we want. Um, we can buy, we can do some repairs if we need repairs, but we're, we're all good. Um, new, we don't have a weapon system. We should probably buy one. Um, we do have to go turn in. Here's, if we need some modules to go fix up some various, well, to fix up modules, uh, we can purchase them here also. Um, here is, if we want to buy a new ship, we can do that. The Spartan is here. Well, that's the kind of, same kind of ship that we have, so no need for that. Um, let's go visit, um, there's a bar, another bar, and here we go. So we have our hydrogen. We're going to go ahead and sell all this hydrogen. Contract completed. we got some extra cash. Excellent. Let's see if we can get a new contract. This guy wants to need to go to Pentinet Commercial and deliver temperature control required. I don't have temperature control, so I can't even do this mission. Okay, so we won't do that one. Um, any passengers want to go anywhere? I don't know where these places are. Uh, Lita Teal. You want to go to Sagan's Lights. Oh, nice name. For 119 bucks. It's probably far away, but I'll take it. Sure, I'll, um, hang on. Let me, let me see about something else. You know what I should do? I should get a loan so we can buy some guns. 2% interest, 2% interest, 2% interest. Let's take one out of the Quay Financial Services. I'm going to take a loan. Two grants. We got 4,700 bucks now. Let me go. Um, oh, there's bounties on here too. That's a lot of money. That's a lot of money. I didn't show my sector map of... I didn't show the sector map. I just showed the the, the system I'm in right now. I should go do that when I get back. Um, so we've got cash now. So let's go. Um, can I talk to you? You look new. You up on that boat that just turned up? Uh, yeah, that's me. Great. You the owner or just operator? Um, who's asking? Name's Scud. Scud De La Vinci. Imports and exports here in Leo, and I got, well, a problem. Go on. So, uh, look, I'm in a bind. Trying to broker a little deal here, but my ship's in the shop, and I'm in need of a go-between. Most of my friends are off-world and unavailable, so I thought I'd try to recruit the help of a fellow freelancer. Oh, this doesn't sound... This sounds a bit shady. Should I go on, or are you about to tell me to jump out of an airlock? Um, I'll hear you, I'll, I'll hear you out. I'm not happy to, but I'll, I'll do it. Cool, cool. Um, the Chancellor Tammy Black spearheaded an effort to outlaw sand. What's sand? Really? You don't know? I, I don't know what sand is. No, I'm sorry. I don't. It's a recreational drug. Legal across the whole cluster, but not here all of a sudden. Well, what happened? 
potential issues with. It doesn't matter. <laughs> okay, okay. Let's not discuss this. Okay. Uh, we had this big shipment sent here. Ready to sell, and bam, now it's illegal. You trying to sell it to me? Well, yeah, that's a, that's a problem. It sure is. I now have thousands of credits worth of product. I can't legally sell here. Already going to lose money, but I don't want to lose all of it when some Border Patrol nut finds it, confiscates, and sells it. Uh, and on sells it to some mate of his. Um, what do you want me to do? I need you to talk to a contact at the Cornerstone Bar on Port Crawford in the Tega Star System. Her name's Sam. Can't miss her. Blonde girl. Um, tell her I have a thousand keys for her at 20 per, 20 per key. I honestly want to get rid of it. Go as low as 15 if I have to. But if you can get it to if you can get her to go for 20, I'll throw in another 400 credits for you on top of the first 1200. I need more money for this. More money. I'm already offering you a bonus. I can't do any better for you or I'll lose money in the shipping costs. Fine, fine, I'll do it. I'm not carrying any any loot. I'm just going to talk to somebody. No problem. Just a little chit-chat. Check give you location. You uh, bring that back to me at Prefect Outpost, which we are not at right now. Don't risk comms or anything. Just Tell me in person, then I can get our stuff moving to meet her. I'll pay you once you give me the coordinates and proof you spoke to her. Yeah, what kind of proof? She'll know what that means. Um, Alright, I'll meet you at Prefect Station. See you there, owner-operator. Yeah, sounds like a, um... Yeah, making good deals here. <laughs> okay, uh, yeah, we'll go do that. Um, sure. Why not? Um, so I guess we're good to go. So let's go ahead and uh, request permission to leave and figure out how to get to wherever she's at. Let's shut the airlock up. And we need to go... Do I have any mail here? I always have mail. New contract. We are pleasure of informing you that additional contract opportunities are being made available to you. Oh, yeah? Where? 180 credits transferred to my account. Uh, Leslie, leave me alone! Uh, okay, so let's go out. Did I get new contracts? I didn't see any new contracts. Ah, forget it. Let's just deliver this girl. Or to this girl. Okay, so yeah, we have a map here. We can go into the cluster and see all the whole cluster. So she's in the Tega system. So we gotta find our way there. Okay, we'll, um, we'll see if we can do that. That shouldn't be too, too difficult. We gotta figure out how to get to the Tega system, but that should be fine. Um, let's go ahead and undock. Undock clamps. Detach from shore power. Sure. Prepare for launch. And away we go. Now, we can uh, manually control us also if we want. And then burn and then, and then stop us from spinning, that kind of a thing. Um, but I think we're good. We're going to go ahead and run to the Tega jump gate. Right over here. Plot a course here. And engage. Because we go talk to Sam. We can see it on here. We can pull up. It's all shaky. You can turn that shakiness off. I should have done it. Uh, no cargo. I have broker a sand deal for Scud De La Vinci. Yeah, that's it. Visit Sam Cowart at Port Crawford in a Tega system. Port Crawford. Okay, we can do that. Seems easy enough. Uh, we got something questionable out here. Which, um, I mean, we could, we could fly there, I suppose. I guess we're getting readings of a drive. Like maybe something was. Maybe something was there. We could go look there. Uh, no, don't do not do that way. Um, delete that. Delete that jump. Cancel that. Delete that one. We could, we could just go here. Just plot a course over there. Let's see what that is. Engage. Maybe it's something... Maybe it's something salvageable. Can I turn this thing on? Uh, uh, a, little low on, a little low on power here. Oh, there it goes. Now it's going back up. Let's see what we can find here. Oh, I meant to go buy a weapon system while I was there. I forgot. Whoops. That may be important. We got cops out here, but we're not carrying anything illegal. We're just we're just talking. Nothing to worry about here. So what is this thing? Do we know what it is? Unknown, unknown. It appears to be nothing. Right? We're stopping. Attention freighter nomadic brigand. That's not me, right? What's, what's my name on my ship? Ventari, is that me? 
Uh, no, there's nothing, there's nothing here. Alright, so... That way. You can scan me all, all you want. I got nothing. Okay, let's go ahead and crank up the speed here. And head that way. So he's probably going to scan me. Yeah, he's going to... Is he docking with me? Contraband detected. Not, not, not me. That's not me. It's the Rota. I, I'm the Rota. Travel safely, Rota. Well, thanks. Thanks. Let's turn this thing around. Oh, yeah. Engage. And get out of here. To the dump gate. To see if we can go uh, have a chat. We've got another, another question mark over here. Yeah, we're getting nothing. I guess I, I could get... There is no IFF, so it's not... We don't know what... No... No, uh... Their thing is off. I could turn mine off, too, I suppose, if I wanted to. And, and maybe fly silent. Um... Yeah, we don't know what it is, though. But I guess we could get better... Better scanners, maybe figure that... That kind of stuff. So, to the jump gate. I've never used a jump gate before, so I don't know how this works. Okay. Non-contact stability clamps extended. Attached. And. Sinking. Done. Locked. Pay a fee, 22 bucks. Sure. Paid. Now, let's jump. Everything's so good, right? Nothing broken? Okay, good. Systems are re rebooted. <laughs> okay. Okay. Everything's in good shape, right? Let's go check the uh, batteries are looking good. Everything looking good over here? Navigation is down, but... Oh, no, it's not. It's good. It's good. Okay. Um, everything looking all right? Okay, so we gotta go to... Where do we have to go? Will you stop scanning me? I got nothing. Port Crawford. There it is. Plot of course. Engage. Okay. And away we go. Scans are clear. Well, they better be because I'm leaving. Let's make our way. That we got another question mark over here. We don't. We don't see. This is a different. This is a different kind of blip. So I guess as we spend time playing the game and learning this stuff, we may learn what these blips mean. I think it has to do with like different different signatures, depending on what frequency it is and all that. And um, yeah, interesting, very interesting. I have an SOS beacon I can activate too if I wish. I think we're good. Um, I appear to be moving very slowly. Can I get um, very shaky here? What's my RC? What is this? Batteries are lo looking. Can I um like? Are you broken? Is that what you're trying to tell me? This one. You looking okay? What is what is RCS? Is this fully functional? Okay. Well, I won't I won't break you then. Everything's connected. Everything's working. Power drain is a lot. Um, I can turn off something. I suppose if I need to. Turn off sensors. There we go. <laughs> yeah, sure. Who needs sensors? How we do? Are, we still, are we still making our way there? We're just going very slow. I don't know what to do to make it any, any better. We have no no sensors now, but we're going to try to make our way there eventually. We are, um... Let's see what else we can turn off. What is this? Turn it off. There we go. Batteries, batteries going back. We good now? Maybe we're going through a nebula or something? Yeah, we're back up to normal speed now. Okay, so what can I turn it back on now? No, it's like killing my battery. Whatever this is, it's killing my battery. Uh, F. Gutierrez has sent me a um, message. All right, let's see what old Frank has to say. Uh, this one here. Canceling transport job. Passenger transport job from... Oh, okay. Whatever. Um, oh, okay. Urgent transport stop. Urgent need of traffic passes from Pentonent Commercial to Columbus Central. Ah, I gotcha. What? 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 What's going on? Why is it getting so... Oh, oh, because I flew right by the sun. Oh, we should probably watch out for that kind of stuff. 
We got a little bit of damage here because of that. My uh, my wing, my solar wing got a bit damaged. I got some light damage on my main my main hole here because I flew too close to the sun. Okay, okay, noted. Looks like there's some maybe asteroids over here also. We're just trying to go to Port Crawford to make a drug deal. All right, game, play nice. What is that? Is that the planet? No, it is a planet. Uninhabitable. Okay, we made it. Lots of things going on here. Yeah, yeah. Docking clamps. We made it. Got a little bit of damage here, but we're just going to chat with her. we got to go all the way back to the other station and let the guy know that we made the deal. Okay, we made it. Let's go, uh... Let's go to undock. See what the station's all about. Hello. Uh, so she's in the bar. Which is... Well, let's take a look at the, um, the mechanic first. We got some things we need fixed up. How much? Oh, that's cheap. Yeah, fix that thing up. And fix up the hole. There we go, all better. Okay. Um, where is... Here we go, Cornerstone Bar. Is it you? Sam Coward. Hey, that's you. That's you. Uh, Scud sent me. Oh, did he now? Great. He, uh, say what he was sending you for? A thousand keys of sand? We'll just, we'll, we'll play it quiet. He's got some goods he wants to move over in Leo. Huh. And would those goods be something quite legal to ship here in Tega, but not so legal in Leo? That's all right. A thousand keys of them. That I can work with, she says. What's he asking for? 25 credits per key. 25? That's steep, especially given his product is hot over there in Leo. How about 15? How about 20? 20. 20. Look, all right. I can do that. Yeah. Done. I needed something to prove I spoke to you. Okay. That's fair. Tell Scud we'll make the trade at this usual spot in Quadrant D of Tega. Okay. Pleasure. All right. Can I go in the bar? I can. Uh, welcome to the bar. Uh, welcome to the back room of the bar. <laughs> can I talk to that guy? Oh, there's a terminal. That does something. Port Crawford administration. Anything else over here? No? No? Can I go in there? No? Okay. Well, um, let's go see if we can find... I mean, while we're here... Let's see if we can have a contract here. Nothing? No contracts? What about passengers? Rosie Station and Cal Callisto Station. I don't want to go anywhere there. Um... I'm not going to do a bounty. Licenses. Are we, oh, there's nothing here. Sometimes you get licenses to work for different companies. But uh, I've not found that yet. Uh, that's to leave. Where is the way to get me uh, my ship modules? I want to buy some modules. Can I not buy any modules here? Here it is. I want to buy a weapon system. Hacking suite. No. Helm computer. No. Good. I want jump drive, nav computer, where's weapons, gotta be weapons here, main drive, these are expensive, there's point defense systems, which is something, I suppose, but I want a weapon system, there's a lot of stuff here, oh here we go, here we go, here's one. For 51. I don't quite have enough for that. Hmm. 51. I don't have... Oh. Yeah, that's all That's all you have here is this, the one? Mm, all right. All right. All right. Well, maybe we won't buy a weapon system just yet. We can load up some armaments if we if we get a weapon system. But whatever. Um, all right. Well, we're already at 24 minutes. We're going to call it a day here. But uh, I'm going to head back. And uh, let me know if you want to see more of this. We'll, I may do a little bit more, another episode of this. Because I'm intrigued. And I want to head back and see what this guy has to say about his drug deal. Permission to uh, leave, please. I'll shut the door. And let's get out. Oh, by the way, there's my room. Back here. One time I went back in there and the game crashed. So I'm going to try to avoid going, going back in there. But I have a bedroom. You can't do anything in there, though. Okay, so, um, yeah. Um, let's go back. We have to go just go back and talk to the guy. But we don't want to go by the sun, right? We want to go there. And then to the, uh, well, we don't know where. We had to undock first. 
But okay, we're calling it a day here. Thanks again for watching. Again, this is Objects in Space. It's available on Steam and GOG. I'll have a link below. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time.